It's also important to reaffirm our strong and unwavering commitment to the independent Israel nation into the future. We want to show that our support for Israel is clear and unwavering. My friend Ted Bailey made his support for Israel evident by his condemnation of the BDS movement actions and coined the apt term for them as BDS, bigoted, dangerous and shameful. Yeah. And I wholeheartedly agree. Yeah. But one of the things that we are proud of in Victoria is that both sides of politics are united in their support for Israel and the Jewish community and there's universal support from the Leader of the Opposition myself for Israel and the independence of Israel. And of course many people have asked me about my own name, Naphtali, which it clearly has a close relation to Naphtali, which is one of the 12 tribes of Israel. I've yet to cement that connection. <laughs> I'm happy to claim it tonight. <laughs> and, uh, because we in Victoria are very, very proud of the Jewish community in Melbourne and Victoria. This support is evidenced by the number of politicians from both the government and the opposition who visited Israel over recent years, and the growing ties between a variety of organisations in Israel and Victoria. As the Ambassador told us, Israel is unique and faces challenges which are far different than we in Australia can sometimes imagine. Tonight we pay tribute to the realization of a dream that existed in the prayers and hopes of our people for thousands of years. Tonight we honor a long-held aspiration that has thrived as a reality for the last 65 years. Tonight we celebrate a miracle of a people like no other. Today we have the duty to vigorously pursue the promise of peace and to transform this hope into reality.